Elm Street has been made. Ah, up for hours. I am so back to another vlog with me you guys enjoyed my last one so i'm going for a royal ball <laughs> like because i'm royalty but anywho i'm going for a royal ball this weekend so this vlog is going to be like my entire week and then they into the vlog so i'm trying to <laughs> see again i am trying to make three dresses today is monday i work full time today i feel like i'm this week i'm actually working extra time because i got new hires i need to tend to but i'm working full time and i gotta make three royalty worthy dresses so just stay tuned and see if it works out but definitely i'm taking you guys to the ball with me okay first off these are my sketches i'm making three dresses but the the third one i don't need to sketch because i know what it's typically going to look like hi kovu Okay, so these are my sketches. The one Kovu is touching is my own dress. The other one is my sister's dress. And then the third one you guys are going to see. Kovu, you want to say hi, Dad, bad? Just say hi already. It's currently like 2 p.m. on Monday. So, um, yeah, I already went to work and I'm back from work. And I'm just about to start sewing. But first, I got to go clean my sewing room. And well, you, you you know what? I'm just I'm not gonna talk through this vlog. I'm just gonna let you guys see. Life goes up and it goes down. I know my mom taught me that. I figured why we fool around so little, and we keep track of time. With four, my cat's in the background. Yes, baby. <sighs> Mommy's working. Cat is literally. Come here, baby. Just such a big baby. Can't can't I work? Anna, you don't want me to carry you. Fine. Okay, I'm taking you outside then. Don't disturb me again, please. I'm recording. All I'm going to do is cut out. <sighs> Zuko, you're not, you're not helping my career. I'm trying to make money off of YouTube. But I'm not gonna wake up, wake up. Okay, so I'm done with one of the pieces. I'm just going to go ahead and. Uh, you guys can see it in the background. This is but I'm going to go ahead and keep sewing this one, which I was working on since last week. I'm just working on it here and there. I'm going to have a client come collect it next weekend. So it's not really a rush compared to the ones I make. I just want to work on it interchangeably. So I do have to sleep at like 5 or 6. I do not know what the time is right now. But I'm going to go to bed at like 5 or 6 because I'm working in Pearland tomorrow. And it's kind of like an hour drive away from me. And I got to be there at 1am. So I got to get my rest in. But I'm going to see you guys tomorrow. I'm not gonna play nice I'll be the witch you tell your friends about I'm the crazy ex-girl you pretend you don't know Cause you know I could ruin your life Rumor has it you have someone new She'll regret you like a bad tattoo Cause you'll never change, you'll always stay the same Go on and tell all your friends all about me don't give her nothing sticks to me, baby Yes, hon, I'm Teflon, I don't give an F So go ahead and tell them I'm a little bit too much for you Maybe you're not man enough Cause I speak my mind, yeah, I speak it out I don't care about If you think that I'm a little bit too much for you Maybe you're not man So today is Tuesday. I went to work at 1 a.m. I worked at a different side today. I got back at like uh how can I get back? Hmm. My brain just froze. Okay, so I got back at I left there at like 10 30. So I got back at like 11. Then I took a nap from like 12-ish till 2. So it's currently 2 o'clock. And I just said, okay, I wanted to come sew, but I wasn't really getting inspiration to sew like the other dresses I was working on for like the royal ball. So I'm deciding to like just go ahead and sew the client dress I was working on last night. So I'm doing that, but I'm really craving tacos and I don't want to go out to go buy tacos. I'm waiting if I can bribe my sister to get me tacos. But right now I'm just sewing that. Um, th that's basically what I'm going to do for the rest of the day till tomorrow. Just keep sewing. <laughs> Watch the sun go down over 
the same old town Like so many times before we Look at the same old stars Battle the same old wars Like so many times before And I know that we're not perfect This out oh, ho 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 this outfit that I have just finished is mm, I wanted something simple in my head but the simplicity cool it did not come it didn't come let me let me give you guys a small sneak peek sneak peek of mm. you see how you see how it's looking like my spread on the money oh god I look crazy but I'm so excited about this first piece I finished mad like I designed it for oh god I have talent Someone should, someone should discover me now. Okay, it's it's currently nine o'clock and I have to go to work at twelve. But I want to start the second, bro. I'm so excited about this first piece. Eh? I can't wait to see it on her. I can't wait to start it on her. I can't wait for that. I've, I've lost today's today's Wednesday. I haven't started the second one. And ah, today's Wednesday. I haven't started the second one. I gotta go to work early. Tomorrow is the only day I have because Friday is like uh, okay. I'll try and see if I can on Friday, but I have to finish the second the second one tomorrow, and then I always start my own last. Why do I always do this to myself? Why why do I always do this to myself, bro? Okay, so I'm gonna go sleep. <sighs> I'm gonna go sleep. Should I go sleep? Actually, no. I'm going to start, start like maybe join the line or maybe the top for the other one. I want to try sewing technique on that one that I've never tried before, so it's going to take time in case I make error. Ah, oh, good. Okay, 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 okay. I'm letting you guys know what I do tomorrow, but so far I'm done with one piece and it's Wednesday. Basically, it took me three days only because I was making it in correlation with the other customer code that I was making. So, tomorrow my plan is to finish this custard camera and chicken. I may try for this on the side, I'm not gonna carry it, but tomorrow I plan on i have to go to work at 12 because i got new hires coming in tomorrow so i do plan when i come back from work i'm going to sew the second dress i feel like my own dress is going to be easy <sighs> my, own, my own has petticoat on that ew okay okay i have talked i have spoken too much my aim in this vlog was not to talk but actually to show if you can see i haven't noticed but i've talked too much in this part so i am going to go ahead and go and sleep and refresh my body for tomorrow when i'm going to kill you guys on that version oh Oh my chisels! Hi guys. Okay, so uh, today is Friday. I didn't do. I didn't. I didn't vlog on Thursday because I just wasn't feeling out. I just wasn't feeling it. I had a lot of things to do with my phone, so I didn't get a chance to use my phone to vlog. I, I went late to work on Thursday. Not really late per se, but I went in like two hours late, and I went in late today again on Friday. So yeah, there's that. But basically, I'm done with almost done with two of the dresses i just have mine left to make i don't know why i do this myself and make mine last i'm supposed to be selfish and do my own first but i don't know i, I, just, I just always treat myself last in everything now that i think about it maybe i'm saving the best for the last i don't know but yes yes that was okay pretty much i just went late and because i went late it just spoils my whole mood then i have to use my phone to upload a video to youtube so when i'm uploading i have to download it from the app 
and then I have to upload it so I couldn't use my phone to vlog and I don't have another camera so that's why there's no vlog for it today so about the video some people had issues with it I don't understand why but like there's some concerns about it I guess they didn't really get the point of the video my it felt like I was nagging about somebody when I did okay I probably didn't state this in the video but it was this whole thing wasn't about one person it was about like different people I just merged their stories to make it seem like it was one person so if there was like the disconnect there or like a missing translation sorry if I wasn't video you can't see it there it's just how i felt i just like to be real with my feelings and not sugarcoat things i feel like many people feel this way but they just like to like you know ignore anywho um today i went to go wash my car i'm about to eat cup noodles let me put you guys on to like only the best cup noodle i love this it's a shin cup noodle it's spicy see I, I used to not like cup noodles like try this cup noodle and this cup noodle is my Go to for everything, so I'm just going to make this and then you know have my sisters try their clothes. And I'm going to um, maybe start on my own clothes today. Today's Friday, event is tomorrow at 8, so I literally have hours left and I haven't started my own dress. I'm going to go ahead and start that. I do not know if I'm going to be vlogging because, again, I'm not really you know in the mood to be putting camera on. It's a lot of work, but anywho, we'll see how the rest of the day goes. But right now, it's quite late too, and I gotta go for Bible study at 7. So I usually have from 2 to seven to so I, I need to take a nap for going for so I don't sleep. Stay here forever. I'm loving this moment. Oh, would you stay till the morning light? Oh, would you follow me? Oh, would you let it be if I leave tonight? Why are our faces swollen in the morning? Like, I just look horrible in the morning. I want to see if everyone's woke up next to me. But anywho, uh, I, I didn't even get to like film a lot yesterday because I didn't really do much. I just ended up cutting the top part of my own dress. And then I went for Bible study and during Bible study, one thing that they mentioned, like the, the whole theme or topic for the day was about loving. I've forgotten the exact word, but it was about the example of David, how when he, when he heard about the death of Saul and Solomon, no, oh good. Saul and Jonathan, when he heard the death, when he heard about the death of Saul and Jonathan, how he reacted, Saul was trying to kill David literally all his life, but he was still very sad that Saul died. So it was about not rejoicing over people's downfall. And that topic, like, it really hit me because it's a very hard thing to do. Like, when somebody literally hates you and somebody is trying to kill you and the person dies, like, how are you supposed to not rejoice? Like, it's a very hard thing to do, but I really appreciated that lesson from that day. It's been, it's been making me think, like, you know, how can I not rejoice if something bad happens to somebody i like you know it's something we all need to put into perspective i, I just have to share that piece so for today it's currently eight i'm so tired i even woke up late so it's eight i'm gonna start sewing my own um my own i'll start sewing my own dress i must i'll start sewing my own dress and then i, I think i'm about to attend this morning it's supposed to be for two hours but i think i'll do for one hour today so i can get more time to sew and then i'll just keep on sewing <sighs> and then my hair i don't know what i'm going to do to my you know what you guys i'll just see how the day goes Okay, so I just got done with preaching. It's currently 11. Alexa, what's the time? It's 11.20 a.m. You heard it from Alexa. So, meaning I have less than seven hours left for, to go to the event. But I want to say I have like five hours left to finish my dress, which I have barely started. And, you know, finish the rest, do my hair, do my sister's hair, do my makeup, do my own makeup. I have like five hours to do all of that and I want to nap before the event so that I don't go and sleep because there's something happens to me once I'm outside and it's like six o'clock I would literally start falling asleep I've gone to dinner a lot of times with my friends and it's like it's six and I'm sleeping in the restaurant it's embarrassing I don't want that to happen today so I got to take a nap so I'm just gonna go finish my dress right now by the way I haven't showed you guys this this came in a couple days ago my sister designed it so the main reason for us going for this event is like you know to network and meet people you know show off our dresses so this is my business card designed by my sister bro i'm taking my waist measurement and i just discovered how much weight i have lost my waist used to measure 27 inches i'm measuring 24 inches now i'm skinnier than my sisters are bro how much weight have i lost <laughs> Oh, Papa Joe. Uh -uh. Wow. I'm having a writer's block, but in fashion, I'm having a creator's block. Ah! I'm four hours. I have no idea how I'm going to cut out the bottom part of my dress. Uh, see, it, I know I can do it gathers, but if I do it gathers, it's not going to be as full as I want it. It's ah, uh, good. So my cat Kovu does not have any sense of time, and he decides to lie down here. So. I mean, 
it's his world i'm just living in it so and now i'm losing sleep what if i lost touch okay so i'm almost done with mine and ah uh, all of a sudden i just feel like every single thing i've made sucks literally like i, I, I always get this feeling and i hate it so much i want to get rid of it but it's like when i'm sewing at a particular time i just i just feel down like like everything i made is not fine anymore like it didn't come out like the way i wanted it like like my sister, my sister tried off her dress and it's nice it's not it's not, it's not nice it's just it didn't come out the exact way i wanted it, it didn't come out like to perfect uh, and it's it's making me i'm even thinking i'm not going to post this vlog anymore i'm just i just feel like this whole week was a waste i don't know i don't know i'll just see i'm, I'm almost done <sighs> i don't know what to do i didn't want to go for the event again <laughs> let me just finish mine and see what it looks like on me if, if it not come out the way I want it to come out, I will just sit in my house and not go anywhere. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> it's currently 6 o'clock and my hair is still looking like this and I have no idea what to do with it. See, I wish this was a live so you guys can tell me what to do with my hair because I literally have no idea what to do with my hair. The, the closest thing I can do uh, is going to be fast and not waste time. It's going to be like slicking it down, doing like a ponytail or a low ponytail. But I don't want to put gel on my head. I'll just end up. Uh, I don't want to wash my hair. I'll just end up having to do that now. Okay, so right now I'm about to head to the beauty supply to go see if I can buy something for my hair. Let me show you my outfit. Even homeless. This is how I'm going to go because I don't have strength for stress. It's six o'clock already. <laughs> I have to do my hair. I have to do my two sisters' hair. Why can't they even do their hair themselves? Come think about it. I have to do their makeup too because I don't have to do makeup. I have to do mine. Ah oh God, it's giving. I'm about to be tired. And oh, the event is nine, not eight. But we don't have to get early, like you know, on time because I really want to take pictures and I don't even know. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go now. Especially when she's reckless. And babe, you're my bestest friend. Yeah, she's my bestie. My love for you is endless back from the beauty supply it's 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 giving slick down and anyway, i want to go take my bath and then i'm gonna come start on my sister's hair and their makeup and i'll do mine last I, as always i i tell i need to be selfish i don't know why i always do this for this girl and co oh baby say hi say hi say hi to youtube say hi youtube say hi now don't fall my hand baby he's like get that camera off my face <laughs> We did something wrong. See what you don't buy food. Oh, people, people are listening now. So much people are saying, "Oh, I'm hungry." No, I don't because I said I don't have time. I give you just now. This is the solution you give. If we have something in the house, I'm not buy food. We have Indomie. Let's cook the Indomie. Nobody wants Indomie. So you that we this that this solution? What don't us cook? I don't want Indomie, she doesn't want Indomie, what do you want to do? Okay, you, you don't want Indomie, but then you say, okay, let's come back and cook. What is that? Okay, since you want to order, order up. I'm not ordering anything. Do you know how much? Order up. I ended up doing my hair. I mean, it's not too bad. Uh, my lashes is. I, see, I didn't want to start wearing my makeup. My face looks like a different color of my body. Oh. Me and you, we can be something we want to. When I see the dream we're chasing, you hey, don't care for me. me. Yeah, yeah. Man, we made your best man. <laughs> we're free to be first class, wedding cash should be. Oh, yeah. I wanna know it tonight. I wanna be.
Ima again a valley location of our house. Even I'm saying that to us. So I just realized I haven't shot the outro for this video, but let me tell you guys how yesterday went. So yesterday was pretty much fun. Uh, when when we first arrived, it felt kind of like boring because we're just standing around and there was live music going on. It just felt it, it was like, it was like a new kind of feeling. It was like it felt like rich people's party. So it started with like you know, and they weren't playing African music. They were just playing like old music and it was like there was, a, there was live music going on it was like a pretty cool vibe then we did like a 360 thing you guys saw in the video then you know they said play african music and it's like you know that's it so it said to dance and then passed out my card almost i want to say i was the best dressed at that event not just me and my siblings but the best dressed at that event i mean and that was our goal so we achieved it then i got to take a picture with this guy who i think was he was literally like prince charming and he was like i guess we're prom king and prom king. i'm like ah but yeah, it was it was it was okay. It was I mean I I rated like uh, eighty over out of am I doing am I using scale of hundred out of a scale of ten I, I rated eight out of ten. It was it was okay. I I, I got what I went what I went for. I passed on my business cards. Got a lo lot of new links. Everybody literally loved my dress. Like I feel like one million people came to tell me oh I love your dress. I'm like I made it. They're like oh that's you know that's what we want you know to find new clients. I feel like I'll keep going for events like this. You know just to expand my horizon and just to put myself out there as many people as possible know that is what i do but anywho let me know what you guys thought about the whole vlog in general if you want to like keep making vlogs like this just let me know and i'm gonna see you guys on my next video bye